What's good, everybody? You're welcome back to another video. I'm going to take you through um, the trade that we, I took this week and then how the 2023 January 1st week, how it went. It was pretty um, a nice week. We just made a lot of profit in the market. I was able to make 70% of my account equity and that's really really nice this was my first setup which was um gj yes which was gj which was gj so i was just looking forward to sell from this point and it really really play out here was it it, it really really play out after the break of the trend line then boom push all the way to the downside i'm gonna be uh, moving on the, to the chart and then explaining each of them for you so this one is gj and this is also um au DUSD. it looked like this one i was not able to um send the setup on the group but i'll also explain this one this is the profit for a aud this is the profit for aud and then this was good this was good so from this analysis i was expecting since here price break up price break out of this resistance and then now turning to a support gain a support right at this point and now i was anticipating price also give a support here push to the downside or when it break out of the support now i'm retesting it as a resistance and then pushing all the way to the downside I literally um caught these cells right at this point. So we caught the cell, it break out of the um the support region, go for a retest and then push all the way to the downside. We caught this gold straight too, and then also yes, it, it was AUD USD DJ and then gold. So here is the account. I started off the account with this thousand and now i've been able to make um 70 percent of my account equity that means this um january week um week first week has been really really good to me so let's go to the chat i'm gonna be explaining how i was able to take all this setup how it's laid out and my idea or how i was able to take all the trade so let's start off with AUD USD. So AUD USD, you can see there was um a, a resistance here. Price resist uh, rejected here for the first time, and here it didn't touch the resistance really, really well. But it also rejected it. Now price push all the way to the downside. Do it own thing. So the reason why I draw this um resistance to or uh, resistance level here was I was anticipating that price will come. Price will retest this level and then reject uh, and then rejected it re reject it again and then push all the way to the downside. That was how I was able to take this trade. I literally waited wait for price to uh, re revisit this level once again. Revisiting this level once again, then I took my sales position. So this was really really um a nice setup for me. A nice setup for me but this this um nfp trade i couldn't cut this nfp trade because i don't know i i just didn't trade it i just didn't trade it because it was really really a nice setup it gave us um a nice it gave us a nice w pattern which we can also go in for a long ride at this point maybe when price is able to um, move past this level yes we put our buy stop right at this point and then we will taking profit at this point but i didn't trade the nfp so for the upcoming week we can basically for the upcoming week you can see price has also retested this resistance region once again so you will be waiting for a proper confirmation and rejection of candle then we will be selling from that point put our stop losses here 
you will be selling all the way to this level so that's it let's move on to the next one which is g j d b p j p y so the next stop is g j d b p j p y so on this trade d b p j p y you can see there was another um this was a pretty nice and clear setup i have explained this is i have explained this setup in my previous video so make sure you go watch my previous video i, I will leave i will leave the link right on the edge of the screen so make sure you hit it and then go watch it you can see after this impulsive movement there was another nice correction after the nice correction there will be another impulsive movement so that's how basically i use to enter this market after the impulsive movement so when the correction was clearly happening i draw my trend line nicely so after the break of the trend line i enter my position right at that point and then leave the trade to run all the way to my 90 percent through that's how i also took this trade is pretty pretty simple and straightforward and the last setup that i take i took for this week was gold so on gold gold setup too was also clear price action pretty simple you don't have to stress yourself clear chart so on gold to after a break of this level after a break of this resistant level price um gain a support at this point after the support price pushed a little bit to the upside and now price came back on the support level again so i was anticipating that when price gave me uh, give, give me a confirmation or reject here for a while i'll be looking forward to push to the upside but if price break out of this support break out break out of the support and then came back for a retest that means i have to be flexible change my bias to sales so immediately i change my bias to sales i wait for a rejection and the rejection happen and then i enter my trade right at this point leave my trade to run all the way to this point so you can see all my three setup for this week was pretty pretty straightforward and simple you don't have to share yourself you just have to plot do your analysis and wait for the market to come to you so thanks for watching this video all the way to the end basically i just want to explain how my 2023 first week was profitable for me and how i also took all this trade so if you find value in this video please don't forget to hit on the subscribe button don't forget to like don't forget to turn the post notification icon so that i get notified every single time i drop another video thanks for watching guys see you in the next video